I've learned. There's a responsibility that comes with this ability to deliver speech in front of a mass assembly. So I never worry about what you want. I just give you what you need. Food for thought to help feed the mind, body, and spirit. I spit lifelines. Don't you dare call them lyrics. Yo, there's a lot of shit ain't right. And before the end of this night, probably before the end of this poem, some of you may not like us like you did before. <laughs> so with forewarned being foretold, if you're one of those who can't control your emotions, I suggest you go outside for a moment. Because I hate to lose any fans, and I would like to keep a few friends. But there are certain things inside I can no longer keep it in. And this is not a persecution, rather just some expression. So please, let me begin. Don't blame it on me. Blame it on my pen. I'm drawing a line in the sand. To me, this is really getting out of hand, all of this man with man. Can't understand the plan as they try to ban prayer while sinners taking a stand. Grown men's walking around like it's cool that their pants are hanging down. Never thought I'd see the day. 50-year-old men wearing braids. corner popping grandfathers still incarcerated in their mind. You're not supposed to be trying to be down. We need leaders for this time. Mothers not properly raising their daughters, so in turn, their daughters start playing inappropriately with other daughters, left and right wing supporters. Family come now mail ordered. We done changed the order. Homosexuality, promiscuity, normal. Virtues and abstinence, abnormal. Now babies lose their virginity before they leave the womb. Innocence is gone the moment they're born. Roses die growing up with those dawns. Porn is in great existence. Today's music and television, bad influence. Marriage often gets downplayed, but divorce is becoming big business. And I told you in my defense, some of y'all might not like me before I was finished. So to those of you that may feel that way, the only thing I can say is, well, I have known folks not to like me ever since I've known folks. So pleasing this has never been my goal or hope. Which is always told that man who take you places, money won't. So since I don't have the money, I'm hoping my respect and charm will get me over while I put on this Obama front. Call me the poetic Bernie Mac. Now I'll say what you scared to say. But for what I'm seeing, maybe he's leading this country the wrong way. These are the last days. And this also you might not like. But if it be so, we could be looking at the Antichrist or a prototype. Public enemy said, don't believe the hype. And I'm the type that will never be politically correct. I don't believe in politics. They're all lying, conniving, con artists, coerced by lobbyists. Crooked evangelists got religion looking sour and bitter, making it seem like salvation goes up to the highest bidder. I would reconsider putting my faith into the administration because the part of me believe they're working with the Pope on some world domination. Total globalization, 2D, different conversation. Let me get back to my original mission statement. Black male species endangered, but they are a hot commodity. The system had to settle so they could become state property. And probably had I not read so much, I wouldn't be this insightful. But I had to start with the man in the mirror. Rest in peace, Michael. <gasps>